breaking news you guys there's another update and you're still gonna want to hold off on filing your 2023 tax return because congress just struck a 78 billion dollar deal that's going to help millions of people see a larger increase in their tax return and business owners are gonna get more write-offs on their tax return yes 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 the name of this bill is the tax release for american families and workers act of 2024 and it's going to change the child tax credit in four different ways the first way is it changes the calculation of how you get the refund for the child tax credit the old formula you take the money that you make you subtract it by 2500 and then you multiply by 15 percent the new formula it's the same exact way but you're going to multiply by the number of children that qualify and this policy, as you can see here, is it would be effective for tax years 2023, 2024, and 2025. The second thing that it does is it, it increases the amount of the tax credits that you can get back as a refund. The old limit is $1,600 per child. The new limit is $1,800. So you can see a $200 increase for each child that you are claiming. The third thing that it does is is it adjusted the child tax credit for inflation. So it's going to go up each year $100. And the fourth thing, kind of like back in the COVID days, starting in 2024 and 2025, you could use your income from last year to see if you could qualify for an even bigger child tax credit. All right, so let's move into an example of the old formula versus how the new formula is going to work. So let me bring out the calculator. So you're going to take the 14000 that you make in a year, subtract 2500 then you multiply this by 15%, which is gonna give you a $1,725 refund. Now with the new formula, same calculations, the only difference is you're going to multiply by the amount of dependents. So for this example, we're gonna use five. So we're gonna take that, multiply by five, which brings your tax refund up to $8,625. This dual formula is really targeted to help low income families. So you're making anything between thirty to sixty thousand dollars, you're probably not gonna see much of an increase. What? What? This means that business owners can write off assets with a useful life of twenty years or less up to a hundred percent. This includes vehicles and equipment. But if you already filed your tax return, I'm pretty sure you're not gonna have to file a remittance. Just like in the history, the IRS is probably just going to send you a check, credit your account, or you'll be able to claim that credit on your next year's taxes. And a new update is going to come out on the week of January 29th, ironically, when tax season officially begins. So stay tuned because I will be updating you guys that week to see if this bill passed. But make sure you stay tuned because this will help millions of taxpayers get a larger return. If you're a business owner, a content creator, looking for professional tax help, make sure you click the link in my bio to become a client. My name is Ricky, co-founder of Ricky and Nikki Accounting Services. And what we do here is we make taxes very easy to figure out. So give us a follow to stay up to date to get your taxes right.